Dip Tray Schematic allows you to create single or multi-sheet schematics, with or without using hierarchy. We're going to create an example of easy hierarchical circuit. Right above design area, there is a library bar. You can scroll left or right. Let's select Microchip Library. When it has been selected, the list on the left side shows components from this library. Right above it, there is a search box. Type PIC16 F84 to find a component in the library. Then, left-click it and click on the design area to place it. Now, let's select Cap Component from the Discrete Library. Hotkeys R or Space allow you to rotate component before placing. Then, we add power and ground net ports and connect them to proper pins of the microcontroller and capacitor. You can move components and nets to make a good-looking schematic by holding left mouse button, zoom in and out with the mouse wheel, and pan design area by holding right mouse button. Dip Trace allows you to create as many hierarchical blocks as you need and place them inside each other. In hierarchy, the first sheet is always a main circuit and other sheets can be hierarchical blocks. Let's place MC74HC component from Motorola library. As you can see, it has five parts, four N and gates, and a power part. You can place parts one by one or all at once. Let's create an RS trigger. To make a connection, left-click on the first pin, then click on the next pin. Connection will be created automatically. Hierarchical blocks are connected to main circuit using hierarchical connectors. The order of the block pins will be the same as it is on the sheet. Let's connect ground and power. Two wires connected to the same net port will be joined to the same net. It is one of the ways to connect nets without wires. Wires of the same net on different hierarchical sheets are united into global net. Hierarchical connectors and the sheet can be renamed for better visualization. Now let's switch to the first sheet and add two hierarchical blocks. Let's place a bus as well. It can be used for easy connection of wire groups. When connection from pin to bus has been added, it's possible to connect pin to one of bus nets or create a new net. The name will be shown above the connection line. Nets on different sheets can be connected by name. Buses on different sheets are connected with bus connectors. We're not going to use them in this schematic, but it's easy to do. Notice, all wires are highlighted when you place a mouse arrow over them, 